So over here you can see that I have a figxam file and then whenever you work around with a figxam file right here, what happens is that everything gets saved out on the web right here. It is so uh, it is saved out in figxam cloud server. So if you were to go to home right here, uh, you, you will be able to see your figxam file right here. This is actually saved on the web. So if you want to save the file locally, then what you have to do is you have to go around over here on to the menu and then what you have to do is you have to go to file and over here you can see save local copy is an option so once you click on save local copy you can see that this actually opens up right here just like this so you can go around over here on to any of the places that you want to save the file to and then click on save so once you do that what happens is that it is saved out as a jam file right here and if you want to open up this jam file you cannot directly open it up so what you have to do is you have to go to home right here, just click and drag this in. And what happens is that the file, the uh, figxam file gets imported out. So into uh, Figma right here. So it is actually uploading the file to the server first. And now you can see that this is what you have right here. And now you can double click and open uh, the file out just like this. So it is loading out the file from the web again. So you cannot directly open up the file from over here. So it has to be uploaded on the web right here before it, uh, yeah, it opens up. And that is how you can save and open up a local Figzam copy of the file uh, inside of Figma. So I hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.